As I'm sure many of you guys are well aware by now, the Royal High community is always looking forward to new updates when they come out, particularly if they're released with new things to not only come that are brand new, but also changes to previous things in the game that we've already loved for a while. One thing a lot of people really love is when older sets and items have reworks and brand new toggles. And of course, we know there's been a saga recently with many different things coming out to add those toggles into previous items. Now, obviously, I know you guys are excited to talk a little bit today about potential new toggles and ideas from these concepts. Hello wonderful little beans, my name is B and welcome back to my channel. Before we get started with today's video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell and of course you stack could B when buying Robux or Premium. I wanted to just take a moment to say a massive thank you to all of you for watching all of my other channels, my It's B Plays channel with the role play of course, and then of course on top of that also for supporting me on my Spanish channel and of course my vlog channel. I appreciate you guys and extra appreciation to any of you out there who've been listening to my podcast this week with B. It's available on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, and anywhere else that you find podcasts. And I'm really grateful to all of you who've been listening. Now, today, you guys, we are going to be checking out some more of the amazing designs from Miss Luna Arts. As you guys know, they have created some of the most incredible ideas and things we have seen in the past, many of which have ended up with the actual sets the ideas were for coming to the game with brand new toggles. So, as always, when Miss Luna Arts creates something new, I get excited about the idea that maybe one of the devs might see them and maybe these changes could actually happen for real. Now, Little Beans, today we are going to be checking out one particular set that I don't really ever wear, but I did used to wear the legs from it a lot. That's right, you guys. We are going to be checking out the Moncherie set, which is an absolutely beautiful set that now came out quite some time ago, but has definitely never left our hearts. Absolutely, you guys. So let's go ahead and head on over to Miss Luna Art's page and check out these amazing ideas. So as you can see, Miss Luna Art's tweeted and said, I had this toggle mania saved, keeping it for a while now, and I decided to show it today so you guys can have something to see while I work on the calendar. And as you guys can see, this is a Royal High toggle mania for the Mon Cherie set. Now, as you guys can see, starting us off over here on the left, we have a toggle concept idea for reworked berets. The options are for how you could wear the beret, with the first being a forward design, so you could wear your beret slightly tipped forward. The option for a plain beret, making it remove the little icons and then just wearing it straight on top of your head. The use sideways option, which of course, as many of you will know, many berets are worn on a side angle rather than backwards, so it would give the option to wear it a little bit more French, if you will, which is very, very pretty. I like that very much. The original shown here in the center, you can see the difference. It does look very nice. I think that the original beret I don't really wear very often because it's not on the side. So if it was on the side, I think I might be more interested in wearing it. Then underneath, we have got a skirt design, you guys. So this is a toggle for queen mode. In other words, making the dress much bigger, fancier, and poofy so that you can wear it as if you are a royal queen from the French Revolution. I absolutely love this, you guys. It looks fabulous, and I'm very, very impressed indeed by this design. Then we have got a toggle option to remove the birds from the shoes. Now, as you guys know, these shoes are gorgeous. You can see on the center image, the original. They are super, super pretty shoes, and these are one of the only things I've actually regularly used from this set is the shoes. I used to use it with my OC back in the day, back when I used the baby doll dress for my primary OC, and I do like the look of them without the birds, so you can wear them more like clippy clubby little pumps and I think it's very cute. Over here on the right, we have got an option for you to hold the bag that was previously always held as a clutch in your hand as a handbag. The idea for the first one is that you can just put it over your arm and walk around holding the bag so that you don't necessarily always have to hold it in your hand. It also makes it just look a little bit more realistic, especially since the custom hands don't actually clasp a hold of the bag. They sort of just glitch over it, so it would be cool to actually see it laid over your arm like this. And it is also another toggle here to remove the bird 
better and make it so that it's more plain of an option of a bag, which would also make it go better with some other sets if you decided to mix and match. And underneath this, we have got a section for the bodice for you to choose just the bodice, so just only the bodice in the middle, which is just this plain brown piece, then only the top part so that you could use this beautiful, I guess, neckerchief style design with a burr and the buttons to wear it with another corset or bodice from a different set. And then lastly, only the bow option, allowing you to just wear the bow around your neck, almost like it's just a necklace accessory. Then the short sleeves option down here is to make these previously long sleeves shorter, so you can have more options for how you wear them. These look absolutely beautiful, you guys, and I am absolutely, genuinely amazed by how gorgeous they are. I think the developers always do such a good job making all of these custom things beautiful, and I'm very, very excited excited to see what they are going to be coming up with next. Now you guys, I would love to see some more designs from amazing Miss Luna Arts, so if you do as well, make sure you leave a like on this video, subscribe and click that bell. I hope to see some of these designs taken into consideration for future updates and maybe the Moncherista actually get these toggles and I am excited to see what they come up with. Thanks so much for watching Little Beans, if you enjoyed today's video, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, don't forget to click that bell and I will see you all in the next video. Have a great day, everyone. Goodbye.